What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Chantel, also known as Mrs. Unbreakable Timeline here. You can call me whatever you like. You know how the saying goes. And if you are new, hey girl, how you doing? What's up? What it do? What it does? What it been? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell. That way, every time I upload, you guys will be notified. So in this video, I just did a simple holiday guide as far as makeup goes. And I feature the 5 and Below Eyeshadow Palette, which is by Profusion. And also the Smoke and Mirrors Lippy Love Velvet Matte Gloss Set. And you guys will see how I feel about it. I'll also do a like a life update in this video. So you guys know what's been like kind of going on with me as far as like family goes, businesses goes. I didn't talk too much as far as the life update because a lot has gone on but not like that much you feel me so i hope you guys still enjoy the little life update if you guys wish to see how i created this look then please keep on watching on which christmas time i feel sad i can't help it y'all so as y'all can tell by the intro we're gonna be doing a life update i really did not know what i wanted to do with this video so i was like you know what i got some new makeup like a little holiday gift guide type of thing and i was like i don't really know what i wanted to do should i do the holiday gift guide kind of makeup look or should i do a life update so I was like, I want to do a life update while I'm doing the whole kind of gift guide because I only got like two items. I was like, I'll just put it all in one. And also, I got on my robe because, y'all, it's getting cold in Florida. Something that I love. I love this time of year. I love how cool it gets outside. So, I got on my robe, baby, because it's a little cool in the house. I already have my brows done and i'm just going to be showing you guys the products that i'm using because it's all affordable makeup so this is kind of like an affordable makeup holiday gift guide edition so yeah so let's go ahead and get right into it so i'm going to go in with my clinique dramatically different hydrating jelly y'all i had this for a minute y'all know this been my like go to i freaking love this stuff and it's pretty cheap and i like it because i didn't really have another like primer that's affordable so i was like you know what this works really good it's affordable and i love that it has like a water base i always talk about this product so i just want to place that all over my face and even on my neck area and you guys always want to remember to apply makeup on your neck area because that part is important as well. Especially if you're going to be applying makeup down there. So who is ready for the holidays? I know a lot of people is ready for it. Like I said, this is my uh, favorite time of the year. So I'm definitely ready for it. I love the weather. I love just, you know, the, the spirits in around this time. Even though this year it is different. And because a lot of people not in the christmas spirit a lot of people's not working and not only that but we had a death in the family back in may so things are not the same you feel me so i mean i'm still excited for this year but not as excited so really quick i'm gonna go in with this elf hydrating camel concealer satin finish y'all know how i feel about this love and hate relationship <laughs> with her but we're going to apply this on my bottom brow i do not conceal my top brows anymore and this baby dries really fast because it is a satin finish and it's like a matte so that's why it dries pretty fast usually matte products makeup dries pretty fast a lot has happened since my last life update like i said the death in the family and then my like stepdaughter had like a little incident the other day. It's just been a lot going on. My daughters are still doing the distant learning. How do you like mothers out there? How do you guys feel about y'all daughters going back or y'all kids going back to school? Because me personally, I'm not with it right now. But I do want them 
to go to and do like their hobbies that they want to do like my oldest wants to do gymnastics and my youngest loves to draw she also sings i don't think she loves singing but she also sings a little bit um and she wants to play basketball so i was thinking like maybe next month which is january everything hopefully will be a little bit more calm by then and i can let them you know do what they want to do but I don't know I'm still thinking about it because I know a lot of parents that and their kids go back to school or to these you know um the hobbies that they like to do just to keep them active because being in the house all the time is driving people crazy even kids they don't even know what to do yeah so they're still doing that and I might have them do the whole um, gymnastics or whatever they want to do next month my oldest wants to start this month but both don't want to start this month but I'll see it, probably talk with their dad and see how he feels about it too. And also, we moved in with their dad. So, we've been here for a good six, what, six, seven months, I believe. So, since like mid-May. And I love it. You know, some days, very challenging. So, now let's go ahead and go into the foundation. Well, before we go into the foundation, I'm going to go ahead and spray this morphe luminous setting spray it's a setting spray but i'm gonna apply it like a primer and morphe is also very affordable like all this stuff is affordable but i'm going to spray it before i apply my foundation because it's going to act as a primer for me now i'm going to go in with the maybelline dream urban cover full coverage protective makeup sunscreen and SPF 50 and I got it in the shade 340 which is cappuccino a little bit darker than my skin complexion it's all good I don't mind that so I know my skin color will be a little bit a little bit lighter so I'm not gonna apply too much but you can get this from I think I got this from Ulta or you could get it from CVS any drugstore very affordable I'm not gonna apply much I also got my oh why is that like patchy mm -mm. this reminds me of my Smashbox Halo Healthy Glow All-in-One Tinted Moisturizer um it's not like full 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 coverage it's still giving me some you know patches so you definitely would need to apply more if you want like that full coverage look but if you just want a more subtle soft look up makeup look then yeah you can just use this by itself and don't apply too much but i'm going to apply a little bit more so as you guys know i have a video up of like my lash line i got all 3d mink lashes and I have a website finally i wanted to get a different website because this website is just for like people that's just trying to sell like their wigs or something like that that they get from companies so i eventually want to kind of have my own domain but right now i just have timeless shan oh that looks kind of dark i just have timeless shan dot store envy dot com i'm going to put it on the screen that way you guys can come and shop my 3d mink lashes in length 15 millimeter and 25 millimeters and i have right now only have five different styles come check it out they are very affordable as well i'm planning on getting more like more like a natural style lashes because i know a lot of women that i know don't really wear the bold lashes and i did a photo shoot well two photo shoots i have one sunday and then one this past monday today is currently on a wednesday so a few days ago i just had um photo shoots there's two different photo shoots the one on Sunday was for this company. The hotel was super nice. Really cool. I'm going to go back in with the same concealer. And I loved it. The experience was really, really good. I'm hoping to have, like, people book me a little bit more, you know, once I get my name out there better. So, yeah, that was, a, a like, a fun experience. And then, um, two, no, Monday, I had a headshot, um photo shoot just headshots this time but it was from the same photographer that I had with my first photo shoot in the white dress and then the second one was with me on the motorcycle so that's the same guy I'm also going to put his information on the screen and also in the description bar below well if y'all in the Palm Beach area y'all definitely need to check him out he's super bomb and amazing when it comes to photography and he also did my intro 
Let me hurry up because I think my cards are telling me that I'm talking way too much. <laughs> And I'm only on the concealer part. Oh my goodness. So I have that up and I did those photo shoots. And two Mon I keep saying Tuesday. Monday's photo shoot. I wore my lashes. That way I can put them on my website. So they can look a little bit more professional. Because I just have my lashes on the website. And it looks kind of like ghetto. You know. It's not like professional professional. But you can still shop with me. Order from me. So that's that oh uh, what else Chantel what else okay so while we're on business I'm going to show you guys I'm actually gonna try to apply it at the end of this video but I'm going to show you guys really quick let me just blend this out and y'all have not eaten yet oh my goodness bro I only had an orange I was gonna go to Starbucks I think I still am because pictures that I want to take today I need like a Starbucks cup for like a prop so me and my mommy started a business as well and what the items that i'm about to show you guys you can find them on my website we got some masks and on the website it will have the different designs that you guys can put on the mask whatever designs you want very affordable as well the masks are like five dollars it's so freaking cute my mom is a seamstress. I don't know if I told you guys before. I'm pretty sure I did. So she made this mask herself. She also put this on the mask. This picture on the mask. And I just love it. And also it has like these like little drawstrings on the side. I don't know if you guys can see. But it has this drawstring on the side. That way you can adjust it to fit around your ear. Because y'all know like if you tie it around your ear. That mess is so irritating and it hurt and then i'm going to wear this at the end of the video once i do my hair but this is an edge wrap so once i do these edges i'm going to place this on my edges just to lay my edges down and this material is a satin gold freaking love it you guys i'm telling you like my mom is the best so anyways um and these are about eight dollars not bad because most edge wrap runs from 15 and up, which is crazy to me. And then also, also, this is a head like scarf bonnet type of deal, but it goes like this. You get what I'm saying? And I believe this is about 15, 20, about $14. I will have it all on the website, you guys. So please be on the lookout for those. And I also have these earrings you can add earrings to your order for everything i believe it's about 25 dollars check my mom out like i said it's going to be on my website but it's really me and her like business together so baby i'm telling you we're trying to make these queens okay so let's go ahead and move on so i'm going to go in with this wet and wild makeup stick contour makeup stick before i apply any powder now this you can find at the five and below store and the other items i'm about to show you guys the new ones that i got it we actually got it from the five and below so while that is sitting for a little bit i think i'm going to go in now this is not a setting powder this is a sheer tint finishing powder and if you guys see my elf makeup um video where i use all elf products i use this and to be honest, I thought it looked really, really good. Like I said, it's not a setting powder. And if you guys seen that video, you know what it is. I explained it in that video, so go and check it out. But I'm going to place this wherever I put that concealer. And it's going to act as a setting powder. And when I had this on, like that whole e.l.f. makeup, everybody freaking loved my makeup. Even with this sheer tint powder. Oh, and also... I am not working currently. My dude thinks it's best, like, to, you know, that where everything's going on, it's probably best just to relax right now until hopefully everything, you know, goes back to being somewhat normal because we all know it's not going to be normal again how it used to be. The last job that I had, I used to complain anyways. It was far and even though I made pretty good money, it all worked out. How y'all like this robe though? I love it. <laughs> I took it to 
my um photo shoot on Sunday. The photographer was like, mm mm, good thing I brought a, a white robe because that pink one, mm mm. And I'm so happy she brought a white robe because I have one, but that one's not like as good anymore because I had it for a while. So this pink robe was not cutting it. Now the palette that I'm going to show you guys, it have a bronzer in there, it has a highlight, and it also has a um, blush and eyeshadow. So this is the palette that I got from Five and Below, which is by Pro Fusion. It's their beauty book, and it does have a blending brush at the bottom. It has their highlighter, blush, bronzer, and it doesn't have any names to these eyeshadows. It just has eyeshadows, which everybody knows is eyeshadow but when you're buying something like this affordable usually they don't have names it just says eyeshadow on each individual eyeshadow so it does have a clear plastic protection which i love about that and it also has a mirror right here which i also love about that that way you can get closer to when you're doing your eyeshadows you can be a little bit closer instead of just having a mirror right here and it also has an everyday eyeshadow look a how-to blend and everything right now i'm gonna go in with this bronzer right here oh that's a lot of fallout y'all I'm not gonna lie, I'm not expecting much from this palette anyways. Now let's go in with the blush that's in the middle. I don't really go for this kind of pinkish blush, but we're gonna try today. Y'all, this ain't doing nothing. But it's okay. This would be a really good gift for like little girls that, you know, you don't want them to, they want to get into the makeup, but you don't want them wearing like full, full, full blown eyeshadows and stuff like that that's very pigmented because this is not pigmented at all i'm gonna go back in with this morphe luminous setting spray because now we're going to apply highlight and we're gonna see how this highlight does in this palette okay highlight it's a little something i don't know if y'all can see that yeah just a little bit i like that i like the highlight all right so now we're done with the face and then i think i'm gonna do something simple and kind of go back in this palette another time because I know I've been rambling on for a little minute. I'm not gonna lie, I really don't know what kind of makeup look I'm gonna do. For now, we're gonna go in really, really bold and I'm going to take this like brown shade right here, which is like more of a like burgundy brownish shade. Ooh, but that is, girl. I think I'm gonna do one eye and then come back and when I get done with this eye, I'm gonna do the other one. But yeah, you guys, not too much of an update, just trying to make some coins, you know, life, this year has definitely been crazy, scary, all in one. But, you know, by the grace of God, I'm still here and, you know, with my daughter. So, that's the blessing in it all, to be honest. And I'm not doing vlogmas this year. I wanted to. But, like I said, with everything going on and I needed an intro, I was like, you know what? Maybe next year I'll be more on my game. But, if God is willing, then next year, for sure. This eyeshadow is very pigmented, but it is a little patchy. All right, so then to go on the top, like more of a transition shade, I'm going to go in with this shade here, which is more like a brownish, but more like a new brown. Now that brown shade, you can't see because it literally matches my skin complexion. Sorry y'all hear that. They're doing long work. All right, so now I'm going to go to the, in the bottom with the bottom lash and with that same brown shade I'm gonna go in with a darker shade which is really really dark and go closer to that bottom lash I won't lie y'all these um shadows are pretty pigmented though now I'm going to go in with this like shimmer like greenish doo-doo shade <laughs> it has a little specks of gold in there oh yeah baby this is on a whole nother level All right, then I'm gonna take the back of the same shader brush. I'm going to go in, have a little fun. I'm gonna go in with this like goldish, like champagne color, but it has little like green specks in it. So let me come up a little bit closer. I'm gonna spray the other end as well. That way it could just be as pigmented. Oh, baby, <laughs> baby. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and finish the other eye. Once I come back, we're gonna finish off this look. I am going to apply my lashes and everything as well. And I'm going to take my um, LA Colors. I just recently got this. I love that how like natural they look. They're not too big. They're not bold at all. 
and I want you guys to really see the eyeshadow look so these are definitely affordable as well these was only like four dollars like four dollars and I got these at Walmart and then I'm going to also take my elf mascara and jet black or oh, black and apply this so once I come back I'm already showing you guys what I've used all right guys so I just did my hair and everything I just put it up in a little bun but I'm loving this makeup look I was not sure what I was gonna do how it's gonna turn out but I'm loving it, okay? And then I put on this edge wrap. Now I'm going to go ahead and spray some Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. So now let's go into doing a lippy, which I also got from the Five and Below store. So I got this little Smoke and Mirrors Lippy Love Set. They're velvet matte lip gloss set so they're more like a lip gloss and they have five different colors perfect perfect gift for the holidays very affordable a lot of people's not working so a lot of people don't have that money to go out and buy expensive makeup let me see what do, which one do i want to wear with this makeup look i was thinking about doing this hmm but i'm thinking this this shade so it's like a plum like pinkish plum looking shade it doesn't have name to them it does have shea butter infused so shea butter is more like a oily type of base i i feel i'm not going to outline my lips <clears throat> i'm just going to see how this look first pigmented okay mm. Ooh. Mm. Ooh. that's kind of pretty though it is sheer and it's very drying it says it has shea butter in it so to bring this color kind of like settle it a little bit i'm gonna go in with this one which is like an orangey type of shade let me see because this is too bold for me let's see if that brings it down a little bit not really well let's see if we can outline it i'm gonna take my nyx lip liner and it's a brown shade a brown lip liner always brings the lips together okay yeah i must say my mommy did that with this edge wrap it's so comfortable on my head it's not aggravating at all y'all know how sometimes with like edge wrap they tend to be tight on your head and you got to take it off especially when you have to tie it like this in the back it tends to give me like a little headache but this is so comfortable and she did it long enough to where if you want to just tie it in the back like this or you can tie it bring it around again and tie it in the front but i think this it's just perfect like this where I just tied it in the back. And then with the earrings, like, baby, we looking like a black queen over here, okay? All right, guys, so this is the finished look. I hope you guys really, really enjoy. I kept this on because this video was all about the affordability, especially for the holidays. And you guys can get these items for a very, very, very affordable price and i will leave all the links down below and we're gonna see how well this edge wrap does to keep these edges laid Ooh. and just like that your edges are intact baby laid okay i hope you guys really enjoy this little life update of mine and yeah until next time i'll see you guys in my next video bye